Ευλογητός ο Θεός ημών πάντοτε νυν και αήν και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Αμήν. Δόξαση Χριστέ ο Θεός ελπίσιμον Κύριε δόξαση βασιλεύ ουράνιε παράκτητο πνεύμας αληθείας ο πανταχού παρών και τα πάντα πληρών ο θησαυρός των αγαθών και ζωής χορηγός εθέ και σκήνωσον μη καθάρισον μας πάσης κυλίδος και σώσον αγαθέτας ψυχάς ημών. Αμήν. Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος Χειρός, Άγιος Αθανάτος αλέησεν μας. Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος Χειρός, Άγιος Αθανάτος αλέησεν μας. Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος Χειρός, Άγιος Αθανάτος αλέησεν μας. Δόξα Πάτρη και Υιό και Άγιο Πνεύματι και Νύν και Άγιοι και Υιός αιώνας των αιώνων αμήν. Παναγία Τριάς αλέησεν μας και ρελάς αμαρτίες ημών, δώστας και φόρουσαν τις ανομίες ημίς. Άγιε επίσκεψε και ίεσε τις ταινίες ημών, ένα και του νοματός. Κύριε Λέησον, Κύριε Λέησον, Κύριε Λέησον, δόξα Πατρή και Υιό και Άγιο Πνεύματι, και νυν και αή και εις αιώνας των αιώνων αμήν. Πάτερ ημών, ο εν της ουρανής, Αγιασή το όνομά σου, δε το ευασιλεία σου, η νύτη δε το όνομά σου, ως εν ουρανό και επί της γης των άρτων ημών, των επίουσιων δόσιμιν σήμερον, και αφεσιμιν τα οφηλήματα ημών, ως και εμείς αφιέμεν τις οφηλέτες ημών. Και μη σαν έγκυση μα ει πειρασμόν, αλλά ρίσε μα από του πονηρού. Η δύναμη και η δόξα του πατρό και του ιού και του εμπνεύματο νυν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων. Αμήν, σώσον κύριε των λαών και ευλογήσεων κληρονομίων, νίκα βασιλεύση και τα μεβάρων δορούμενων και του οφειλάτων δια του σταυρού του πολίτευμα. Δόξα Πατρή και Υιώ και Αγίου Πνεύμα, Διό Υψώτης εν το Σταυρό Εκουσίως και υπονήμως και νη πολιτεία τους κτηρμούς εδώρης του Χριστέ ο Θεός, έφρανον εν τη δυνάμη σου τους πιστούς βασιλείς ημώνικας χορηγών αυτής κατά των πολεμίων, συμμαχία να έχει εν τη συνόπων ειρήνης αήτη των τρόπεων, και νυν και αή και εις αιώνας των αιώνων αμήν. Προστασία φοβερά και ακατέσχεται με παρήδης αγαθήτας και σύες ημών πανήντε Θεοτόκε. Στηρίξαν οδοδόξων πολιτείαν, σώζευσε και έλαψε στη Λέβην και χορηγεί αυτή η ουρανόθεν και νίκην διότι έτε και στον Θεόν μόνοι ευλογημένοι. Ελέησον ημάς ο Θεός και του Μέγα λέω σου δε μεθά σου επάξον και ελέησον. Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον. Έτι δε μεθά υπέρ των ευσεβών και ορθοδόξων χριστιανών. Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον. Έτι δε μεθά υπέρ του Αρχιπισκόπου ημών Αλεξίου και πάσεν Χριστό ημών αδερφότητος. Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον, Κύριε ελέησον. Ότι ελέημον και φιλάνθρωπος Θεός υπάρχεις και εσύ την δόξαν να πέμβομεν το Πατρί και το Υιό και το Άγιο Πνεύμα την ίν και αή και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Αμήν, εν ονόμα του Κυρίου ευλόγησον δέσποτα. Δόξα τη Αγία και ομοσίου και ζωποιώ και άδειρε το Τριάδι πάντοτε νυν και αή και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Αμήν, δόξαν υψηθώ και πηγή σειρήνη εν ανθρώπης αδοκία. Δόξα ανυψιστεώ και πηγή σειρήνη εν ανθρώπη σε δοκία. Δόξα ανυψιστεώ και πηγή σειρήνη εν ανθρώπη σε δοκία. Κυρία Ταχύμα, ανήξη και το σώμα, αναγκαλίνε εσύ σου, κύριε, τι απληθύνει σαν λιμποντέ με. Πολλοί επανέστανται επ' με, πολλοί λέγουν στην ειδική μου και εσωτερή αυτό είναι το Θεό αυτό. Σύδε, κυρία, αντιληφθούμε, δόξα μου και ειδσόν κεφαλή μου. Φωνή προ κυρίων και έκασα και επικουσέ μου εξ όρου αγίου αυτού. Εγώ δε και μύθιν και ύμψα εξηγάρθεν ότι κύριο αντίληψατε μου. Ου φοβηθήσω με από μυριάδων λαού το κύκλο συνυπεταθεμένων μη. Ανάστα κύριε, σώσο με ο Θεό μου, ότι εσύ επάταξε πάντα ξενοντά μα τι όσο δόντε αμαρτωλών συνέδεψα. Το κυρίου ισοτηρία και τον λαό σου ευλογία σου. Εγώ και μύθιν και ύπνοσα εξηγάρθεν ότι κύριο αντίληψατε μου. Κύριε μου και θυμό σου λέξη με μη δέτε μου σπεδεύσουμε ότι τα βέλη σου επαγισάν μη. Και επεστήριξε με την κυρία σου και στην ιερή τη αρκή μου απροσώπου τη οργή σου, ου και στην ειρήνη εν τη σωστή μου απροσώπου των αμαρτιών. Ότι ανομίου περίραν κεφαλή μου, ω η φωτιά βαρία παρέντησαν επ' με, προσώζε σαν και εσάπησαν οι μολοπέ μου απροσώπου τη αποζήνη μου. Μεταλαιπώρησε και κατεκάμφθηνε ω τέλου όλη την ημέρα, σκυθροπάζωνε πορευόμη. 
ότι εψώημο εμπλήσανε μεγμάτων και ούκαι έστεινε η έτσι μου. Εκακώθην και ταπεινώθην ως φόδρα οριόμιν από στενά μου της καρδίας μου. Κύριε εναντίον σου πάσα επιθυμία μου και ως στεναγμός μου από σου καπεκρίδη. Η καρδία μου ταράζει εγκαταλείπε με ισχύς μου και το φως των δόμων μου και αυτό ούκαι έστεινε με μου. Οι φίλοι μου και οι πλησίοι μου εξεναντίον μου ήγησαν και έσαν και οι εγγυστά μακρόθεν έσαν. Και ξεβιάζουν το ζητήντο στην ψυχή μου και ζητούνται στα κακά μου, ελάλησαν. Ματαιότητα και δολιότητα όλη την ημέρα να μελέτησαν. Εγώ δε ο σκοφό κήκων και ω οι άλλαλο που ανοίγουν το στόμα αυτού. Και γεννόμοι ενό οι άνθρωποι που κακούν και ούτε έχουν το στόμα τη αυτού ελεγμού. Ό,τι επισή, κύριε Ελπίσα, σα άκουσε, κύριε ο Θεό μου. Ό,τι είπαν, μήποτε επιχαρώσει με εχθροί μου και έντο αλεθήν ευπόδα μου. Έπαιμε, εμεγαλωριμώνησαν. Ότι εγώ εισμάστηγα σε έτοιμο και αλγιδών μου ενώπιον μου στη διαπαντό. <coughs> Ότι την ανομία μου εγώ να γελώ και με ρημνήσω υπέρ τη αμαρτία μου. Οι δέχρη μου ζώσει και και κρατέονται υπέρ με και πληθύν τη ανημισούντε με αδίκω. Ή ανταποδεδόνε μη κακάν διαγαθών εν διαβαλών με επικάτε δύο κονογαθό συνήν. Μη εγκαταλείψει με κύριο Θεό μου, μη αποσταπώ μου πρόσει στην βοηθειά μου, κύριε τη σωτηρία μου. Μη εγκαταλείπει με κύριο Θεό μου, μη αποσταπώ μου πρόσχε ει την βοηθειά μου, κύριε τη σωτηρία μου. Ο Θεό, ο Θεό μου προσεώ θρήσω. Εδίψει σε εσά η ψυχή μου, που σαπλώ σι σάρτ μου εν γέρι μου και αβάτο και ανίδρο. Ούτω εν το αγίο όθυνση του ήδη την δύναμή σου και την δόξα σου. Ότι κρίσον το λαό σου περσοά στα χέρι μου επενεσίσε. Ούτω ευλογήσει εν τη ζωή μου και εν το όνομα τη σου αρώτα γύρε μου. Ω εξτέατο και ποιότητο εμπλησί η ψυχή μου και χίλια γαλιάσεω ενέσει το στόμα μου. Η εμνημόνε βόνσου επί τη τορμή μου και τη όρση σε μελέτων εισέ, ότι εκείνη η βοηθό μου και εν τη σκέπτο με τερίγο σου αγαλιάσομε. Εκολύθηκε η ψυχή μου επί τη ζωή μου δε αντελάβει το δεξιά σου. Αυτή η δε εισμάτινε ζήτησαν την ψυχή μου. Ισαλέψονται ει τα κατώτατα τη γη, παραδοθήσονται ει χειρά ρομφαία. Μερίδιε αλλοπέκον έσονται. Ο δε βασιλεύ σε βρανθίσετε από το Θεό, επενεθίσετε πάσο ομνίων. Εν αυτό ότι ανεφάβγει η στόμα, λαλούν τον άδικα. <coughs> εν τη όρθρη σε μελέτων, η σέω τη γενή βοηθών και εν τη σκέπτων τερίγων σου αγαλιάσομαι. Εκολύθη η ψυχή μου, όποιο σου αιμού δε αντελάβει το δεξιά σου. Δόξα πατρί και ιό και αγίο πνεύματι και νύ και αή και ισό αιώνα στον αιώνα να μην. Αλληλούια, 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 δόξα σου ο Θεό, κυρία Λέισον, κυρία Λέισον, κυρία Λέισον. Δόξα πατρί και ιό και αγίο πνεύματι και νύ και αή και ισό αιώνα στον αιώνα να μην. Ο Lord, God of my salvation, I cry day and night before you. Let my prayer come before you and incline your ear to my supplication, O Lord. For my soul is filled with sorrows and my soul draws near to Hades. I am counted among those who go down into the pit. I am like a helpless man, free among the dead. Like slain men thrown down and sleeping in a grave, whom you remember no more, but they are removed from your hand. They laid me in the lowest pit in dark places and in the shadow of death. Your wrath rested upon me, and you brought all your billows over me. You removed mine acquaintances far from me. They made me an abomination among themselves, as betrayed and did not go forth. My eyes weakened from poverty, O Lord, I cried to you the whole day long. I spread out my hands to you. Will you work wonders for the dead, or will physicians raise them up and acknowledge you? Shall anyone in the grave describe your mercy and your truth and destruction? Shall your wonders be known in darkness and your righteousness in a forgotten land? But I cry to you, O Lord, and in the morning my prayer shall come near to you. Why, O Lord, do you reject my soul and turn away your face from me? I am poured in troubles from my youth, but having been exalted, I was humbled and brought into despair. Your fierce anger passed over me, and your terrors greatly troubled me. They compassed me like water all the day long, and they surrounded me at once. You removed from me far my neighbor and friend and mine acquaintances because of my misery. O Lord God of my salvation, I cry day and night before you. Let my prayer come before you, and incline your ear to my supplication, O Lord. Bless the Lord of my soul and everything with him. May bless his holy name. Bless the Lord of my soul and forget in all his rewards, who is merciful to all your transgressions, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from corruption, who crowns you with mercy and compassion, who satisfies your desire with good things, and your youth is re <coughs> renewed like the eagles. The Lord shows mercies and judgment to all who are wronged. He made known his ways to Moses, the things he willed to the sons of Israel. The Lord is compassionate and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in mercy. He will not become angry to the end, nor will he be wrathful forever. He did not deal with us according to our sins, nor reward us according to our transgressions. For according to the height of heaven, for mercy of the Lord reigns in mercy over those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so he removes our transgressions from us. As the Father has compassion on his children, so the Lord has compassion on those who fear him. For he knows how he formed us, he remembers we are dust. As for man, his days are like grass, as a flower of the field, so he flourishes. The wind passes through it, and it shall not remain, and it shall no longer know its place. 
But the mercy of the Lord is from age to age upon those who fear him and his righteousness upon children's children. To such keep his covenant and remember his commandments to do them. The Lord prepared his throne in heaven and his kingdom rules over all. Bless the Lord, all you his angels, mighty in strength, to do his words so as to hear the voice of his words. Bless the Lord, all you his hosts, his ministers who do his will. Bless the Lord, all his works in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord of my soul. In all places of his dominion, bless the Lord of my soul. O Lord, hear, hear my prayer, give ear to my supplication in your truth, answer me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant, for no one living shall become righteous in your sight. For the enemy persecuted my soul, he humbled my life to the ground, he caused me to dwell in dark places as one long dead, and my spirit was in anguish within me, and my heart was troubled within me. I remember the days of old, and I meditated on all your works, I meditated on the works of your hands, I spread out my hands to you, my soul thirsts for you like a waterless land. <coughs> Hear me speedily, O Lord, my spirit faints within me, turn not your face from me, lest I become like those who go down into the pit. Cause me to hear your mercy in the morning, for I hope in you. Make me know, O Lord, the way wherein I should walk, for I lift up my soul to you. Deliver me from mine enemies, O Lord, for to you I flee for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your good spirit shall guide me in the land of uprightness. For your name's sake, O Lord, give me life in your righteousness. You shall bring my soul out of affliction. In your mercy you shall destroy mine enemies. You shall utterly destroy my, all who afflict my soul, for I am your servant. Answer me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant. Answer me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant. Your good spirit shall guide me in the land of uprightness. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God. Our hope, O Lord. Glory to you. Περδισάνω θεωρίνη στη σοντρία των ψυχών ημών του κυρίου Δεϊθόμε. Περ τη ειρήνη του σήματο κόσμου, ευσταθία των Αγίων του Θεού Εκκλησιών, Κρίστων πάντων ενώσεω του κυρίου Δεϊθόμε. Υπέρ του Αγίου οίκου του, του και μετά πίστε ω ευλαβία και φόβου Θεού Ισιών των εναυτό του κυρίου Δεϊθόμε. Υπέρ των ευσεβών και ορθοδόξων χριστιανών του κυρίου Δεϊθόμε. Υπέρ του Αρχιπισκόπου που ήμουν Αλεξίου του Τιμίου Πρεσβυτερίου τη Εν Χριστό Διακονία, παντό του κλήρου και του λαού του κυρίου Δεϊθόμε. For our country, for the president, for all those in public service, let us pray to the Lord. For the holy and great Church of Christ, for this holy metropolis, this parish and city, and for every city and country, and for the faithful who live in them, let us pray to the Lord. For favorable weather, the abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. For those who travel by land, sea, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the captives, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. For deliverance from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, and from the peril of the coronavirus against us, let us pray to the Lord. For our brethren, those who lead the fight against the coronavirus, the doctors, the medical workers, and the scientists, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious Lady, the Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. Ότι πρέπει σε πάσα δόξα τιμή και προσκύνηση στο Πατρί και το Υιό και το Άγιο Πνεύμα την Ιν και Αΐ και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Αμήν, Θεός Κύριος και πέθανεν ημίν ευλογημένος ο ερχόμενος εν ονόματι Κυρίου. Give thanks to the Lord and call upon His holy name. God is the Lord, and he revealed himself to us. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. And that the ethnic Kyklos son may get on a matikiriu iminamin of tus, Theos Kyrios kepefan en imin evelogimenos, o erchomenos en on o matikiriu. Came above from the Lord, and it is wonderful in our eyes. God is the Lord, and He revealed Himself to us. Blessed is He who comes in the name of the Lord. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Mother of Christ our God, all blameless Virgin, most pure, as Simeon told us, sword pierced you through your holy soul. When you saw your Son and God crucified by transgressors, of his own will, O Lady, cease not to importune him, that he grant the forgiveness of failings to us, your servants, only most blessed one. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious <laughs> Lady, the Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend most ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. To you, O Lord. For yours is the dominion, and yours is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Mm -hmm. So son kiri et on laon su ke vlogi son tin kleronomi an su ni kasti de vasila si kata varavaron do rumenos ke to son pilaton di atus tavrusu politema. Exalt the Lord our God and worship at the footstool of his feet, for he is holy. When you were crucified, O Christ, the enemy's tyranny was lifted, and his power was crushed, for it was no angel nor mere man, but you, the Lord himself, who saved us, glory to you. Δόξα Πατρί και Υιό και Αγίο Πνεύματι Ή την σύν προστασίαν και εκτιμένη άχραντε και τες εσύ και εσύες Τον δυνόν εκλητρούμενοι Το σταυρό σου Ιούσιου εν παντή φρουρούμενοι Κατά χρέος επάντες ευσεβώς μεγαλύνομεν. We venerate the wood of your cross, O humane one, for you the life of all were nailed to it, O Savior. You open paradise to the robber who approached you with faith. He was counted worthy of delight, confessing you, remember me, O Lord, accept us as you accepted him. For we now cry, we all have sinned against your compassion, do not abandon us. Ο δε Θεός βασιλεύς ημών προς αιώνος ηργάσα του σωτηρίαν εν μέσω της γης. Τον ότο όπλον του σταυρού εν πολέμησε δίχτυ ποτέ το ευσεβή βασιλίοι Κωνσταντίνο αήτη των τρόπεων κατ' εχθρών διαπίστεως Tu tu tremon sen en anti e dinamis tu to diego ne ke ton biston sotiria ke pablo to kap kima. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Free of blame, the allegorical ulem, 
when she beheld the Lord laid out and crucified, cried out, O oh, wonder most strange <coughs> indeed, O oh, most dreadful of mysteries, how can he who holds the whole wide world in his own hand be convicted by <coughs> unlawful judges and sentenced to death and be crucified? Applausus est agrotas por la masic dirmon, ta es nita mic macrana posu yegonota, Siniga yezoxazisu, tin polina gasotita, hala epim lepson epitin sin tirujian, che catavaletus casimon polemius, stavroto timiosu. Oh, God is wondrous in his sayings. <laughs> The holy martyr suffered painful tortures for your sake, O Lord. Be compelled by what they endured, and heal our every pain we entreat you as the only one who loves humanity. Doxa patrike o geai o pneumati Inim keai keis tu seonas ton eon non nami O aspilus amnas ton amnon ke pimena Cremamen un necron epixilu rasa En da crisi necrargas emitricos alla lazusa Posim niso sutini per logon iemu Singata vasin keta kusi apati Se iperagase According to your great mercy and according to the abundance of your compassion, blot out my transgression. <coughs> Wash me thoroughly from my lawlessness and cleanse me from my sin, for I know my lawlessness and my sin is always before me. Against you only have I sinned and done evil in your sight, that you may be justified in your words and overcome when you are judged. For behold, I was conceived in transgressions and in sins my mother bore me. Behold, you love truth, you showed me the unknown and secret things of your wisdom. You shall sprinkle me with hyssop and I will be cleansed. You shall wash me and I will be made whiter than snow. You shall make me here joy and gladness. My bones that were humbled shall greatly rejoice. Turn your face from my sins and blot out all my transgressions. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, and do not take your Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of your salvation, and uphold me with your guiding spirit. I will teach transgressors your ways, and the ungodly shall turn back to you. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation, and my tongue shall greatly rejoice in your righteousness. O Lord, you shall open my lips, and my mouth will declare your praise. For if you desired sacrifice, I would give it. You will not be pleased with over to offerings. A sacrifice to God is a broken spirit. A broken and humbled heart God will not despise. Do go to the Lord in your good pleasure to Zion, and let the walls of Jerusalem be built. Then you will be pleased with the sacrifice of righteousness, with offerings and whole burnt offerings. Then shall they offer young bulls on your altar. You loved the divine commandments that Christ enjoined, and thus you became a Christ-loving champion of the faithful, brave Pamphilos. That is why we honor you and observe the sacred feast of your memory. Never cease interceding on behalf of us all. Behold the resplendent and radiant divine memory of the mighty athlete and herald of God, Pamphilos, has shined on us again, illuminating everyone's faces and hearts with the light that never sets. Come, fans of church holidays, let us joyfully go and celebrate it. And with songs, let us crown his divine day, for it is a fine annual feast day. In so doing, we bless and extol the Lord who worthily crowned him. And he never ceases interceding on behalf of us all. Interceding on behalf of us all. On the 16th of this month, we commemorate the holy <coughs> martyrs Pamphilos, Valens, Paul, Seleucus, Porphyrios, Julian, Theodolos, Elias, Jeremiah, <coughs> Isaiah, Samuel, and Daniel. On this day, we also commemorate the holy martyrs in Martyropolis and also devout Saint Maruthas, who rebuilt the city and named it after the martyrs. On this day, we also commemorate our devout father Flavian. On this day, we also commemorate our father among the saints Flavian, patriarch of Constantinople. By the intercessions of your saints, O God, have mercy on us. Amen.
Ανοίξω το στόμα μου και πληρώθησε τε πνεύματος και λόγον ρέψω με τη βασιλή Δημήτρη και οφθήσω με φεδρός πανηγυρίζον και ασογηθόμενος τα αυτή στα θαύματα. Establish your servants to exhort you, O Mother of God, for they have formed a spirit to acquire for you the living and abundant found, and graciously in your divine glory. I give glorious crowns to them. When the prophet Habakkuk heard the divine and incomprehensible counsel of your incarnation from the virgin almost high, considering he cried aloud, Glory to your power, O Lord my God. Exestita simbanda hepiti fia doxi su cigarra piroga me parcene. Hesies en mitra ton epipandon zeon que te toca sacronon Pasitis imnusis esotirian brave bondam. O godly minded believers, come and celebrate this sacred and venerable feast and thus extol the Theotokos and clap our hands and glorify our God who was truly born of her. O que la tres antiquis is eotrones paratan disandam alapiros apilin adarios patis andes queron desepsalon Υπερήμνητε ο των πατέρων Κύριος και Θεός ευλογητώσει. Praise and we bless and we worship the Lord. Guiltless were those servants in the furnace. The son of the Theotokos went and rescued them. He who was prefigured then, having been incarnate now, is gathering the whole wide world into his church to sing all your works of the Lord to all ages. Sing praises to the Lord and exalt him beyond measure. Την Θεοτόκον και μητέρα του φωτό εν ύμνη στη μόντε μεγάλη νομέ. Μεγάλη είναι η ψυχή μου των κυρίων και η Γαλλία σε το πνεύμα μου. Επί το Θεό, το σωτήρι μου. Την τιμή ο τέραν των χερουβίμ και δοξοτέραν συγκρίτω των σεραφίμ. Την αδία θόρος Θεών λόγων τεκούσαν Την όντως Θεοτόκον σε μεγαλύνομεν He has regarded the lowly state of his maidservant For behold, henceforth all generations will call me blessed Greater in honor than the cherubim and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God the word, and are truly Theotokos, you do we magnify. O Tiepi Semi Megalia, O Dinatos, 
και Άγιον το όνομα αυτού και το έλεος αυτού εις γενναιών και γενναιάν τη φοβουμένης αυτών στην τιμιωτέραν των χερουβήμ και εν δοξωτέραν ασυγκρίτως των σεραφήμ την αδία πθόρος θεών λόγων τεκούσαν την όντως θεοτόκων σε μεγαλύνομεν. He has shown strength with his arm, he has scattered the proud in the imagination of their hearts, greater in honor than the cherubim and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God the Word, and are truly theotokos, who do we magnify. Kathile dinastas apo thronon ke ipsos et apinus, finondas en neplis en agathon, και πλουτούντας εξ απέστειλε καινούς την τιμιωτέραν των χερουβήμ και εν δοξωτέραν ασυγκρίτως των σεραφήμ την αδία πθόρος θεών λόγων τεκούσαν την όντως Θεοτόκον σε μεγαλύνομεν. He has helped his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy, as he spoke to our fathers, to Abraham, and his seed forever, greater in honor than the cherubim. And in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim, you without corruption gave birth to God the Word, and are truly Theotokos, you do we magnify. Papas Gigenis, Skirtato to Benevmati Lambado Humenos. Πανηγυρίζε το δε αήλων νόων φύσης γερέρουσαν την ιεράν πανηγύριν της αιωμήτωρος και βοάτο χέρις παν μακάριστε Θεότο και αγνή Άγι Πάρθενε Ετικέτη εν ειρήνη του Κυρίου Δεϊθόμεν Κύριε Λέησον Αντιλάβουμε σώσον ελέησον και διαφύλαξον ημάς ο Θεός τη συγχάρητη Κύριε Λέησον Τη Παναγία Αχράντου, υπερευλογημένη εν δόξου, δεσπίνη Σιμών Θεοτόκου και Παρθένου Μαρία, μετά πάντα λαγιού μονεύσεω, εαυτού και αλλού και πάσα την ζωή νημών. Χριστό το Θεό, παραθωμεθά. Φύγει, κύριε. Ότι σε ενούσι πάσε δυνάμει των ουρανών και εσύ την δόξα να απέμβουσι το πατρί και το ιό και το αγιο πνεύματι. Νην και αή και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Αμήν, το όπλον το αήτητον, το στήριγμα της πίστεως, σταυρών των θείων υμνούμεν και προσκυνούμεν εν πίστη, το μεγα κατά φυγίον χριστιανόν το κάπτυμα των ορθοδόξων φύλακα των αθλοφόρων το κλαίος αξίως εφημούμε 
strength, shield, and armor of pious Orthodox Christians of all the victory of rulers and always the fall of demons. O cross of Christ, guard and give grace to us who is sealed and arrayed. Trumpet, praise him with the harp and lyre. You were equal in number to the apostles, all martyr saints, and you share the same frame of mind and holy zeal. You were not frightened by tyrants, wrath, and godless brutality. Rather, you firmly proclaim named Christ as Savior courageously. For this you endured mutilation and torture, O all wise men. But through hope you were already enjoying future divine delight. <laughs> En ite afton en cordes que organon, carteria ni quisandes ton nace on to estis estasin, que piquilis y des y prosplales andes, colastirion ton Stefanon, axios edexas e quirozo archiquis, Clerogi an alothreon, nin plotis andes, en skines eonios to sotiri, que desvoti ton apandon, si vasilevon des endoxi. Praise him with resounding symbols, praise him with triumphant symbols. Let everything that breathes praise the Lord. Let us honor those martyrs, twelve godly-minded Saint Pamphilios, fallen 
Sons and Seleucus, divine Porphyrios, and Jeremiah and Daniel, and that marvelous Samuel, and Isaiah, and Saints Paul, and Elias, and Julian, and Theodulos, let us praise and extol them with our very us inspired hymns and poems, for they were brave for the love of God. <laughs> Keep 
us this day without sin. Ευλογή το Σικύριε, ο Θεός των Πατέρων ημών, και εν ετών και δεδοξεδεμένων το όνομά σου εις τους αιώνας αμήν. Let your mercy, O Lord, be upon us, even as we have hoped in you. Ευλογητός η Κύριε διδαξών με τα δίκαι όματά σου. Blessed are you, O Lord, teach me your statutes. Ευλογητός η Κύριε διδαξών με τα Lord, you have been our refuge from generation to generation. I said, O oh Lord, have mercy on me. <coughs> Heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. Kyrie prosekate pigon διδαξών με το πιν το θέλημα σου ότι εσύ ο Θεός μου. For in you is the fountain of life, in your light we shall see light. Παρά, παρά την ολτό έλεο σου Τις γίνος κουσίσε, Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος ισχυρός, Άγιος αθάνατος, ελέησον ημάς. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Ο Θεός Αγίος Ισχυρός, Αγίος Αθάνατος, ελέησον ημάς. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and forever, and to the ages of ages, amen. For you are immortal, God. Since they possessed your power, they defeated the tyrants, dashing the demons' powerless displays of defiance. O Christ God, at their fervent entreaties, save our soul. O Son of the Spirit, blessed is the kingdom of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen.
In peace, let us pray to the Lord. For the peace from above and for the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. For the peace of the whole world, for the stability of the Holy Church is of God, and for the unity of all, let us pray to the Lord. For this holy house and for those who enter it with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. and Orthodox Christians, let us pray to the Lord. For Archbishop Alexios, the Honorable Presbyterate, for the Diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and the people, let us pray to the Lord. For our country, for the President, and for all those in public service, let us pray to the Lord. For the Holy and Great Church of Christ, for this holy metropolis, this parish and city, and for every city and country, and for the faithful who live in them, let us pray to the Lord. For favorable weather, for the abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. For those who travel by land, sea, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the captives, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. For our deliverance from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, and from the peril of the coronavirus against us, let us pray to the Lord. For our brethren, those who lead the fight against the coronavirus, the doctors, the medical workers, and the scientists, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious the Lady, the Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our Thank God. You, Lord. you belong all glory, honor, and worship to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Proclaim your mercy in the morning and your truth at night through the intercessions of the Theotokos. Savior, save us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Intercessions of the Theotokos. O oh, Savior, save us. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious most Lady, holy, <coughs> with the Lord, 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 and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. For yours is the dominion, and yours is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Praise to the Lord. 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 Praise to the Lord.
praise the Lord, O my soul. I shall praise the Lord while I live. I shall sing to my God as long as I exist. Save us, O Son of God, who are wondrous in your saints. We sing to you, Alleluia. Μακάριος ο Θεός Ιακώβ, βοηθός αυτού, η ελπής αυτού, επί Κύριον των Θεών αυτού. Σώσον ημάς η έθεου, ο εν Αγίης Αμαστός, ψάλλοντας η Αλληλούια. Ο Λόρτ σαν ρήν φορεύερ, Ιορ Κάτος αι αντου ο γενερή, Save us, O Son of God, who are wondrous in your saints. We sing to you, Alleluia. Oxa patrike, O ke agio pnevamati. Now and forever and to the ages of ages, Amen. Only begotten Son and Logos of God, be immortal. You condescended for our salvation to take flesh from the holy Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, and without change became man. Christ our God, you were crucified and conquered death by death. Being one of the Holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and with the Holy Spirit, save us. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious Lady, the Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. For you, O God, are good and love mankind, and to we offer glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Sava mastos o Theos, en tis agis aftu, e martires o kirienti, athlisi afton, Stephanus e commissandotis, Απταρσίας έξω του Θεού ημών, σχόντες γαρτίνης χινσούτους, τυράννους καθήλων, έθρασας και δαιμόνων, τα ισχύρας ράση, αυτόν τεσί και εσείς, Χριστέ ο Θεός, σώσον τα αστικά. Wisdom, arise, come let us bow down and worship Christ. Who art wondrous in your sense. 
Tested for you, our immortal God. Since they possessed your power, they defeated the tyrants, dashing the demons' powerless displays of defiance. O Christ God, at their fervent entreaties, save our souls. Today is the beginning of our salvation and the revelation of the mystery which was hidden from eternity. The Son of God becomes the Virgin Son and Gabriel announces the grace of this good news. Let us also join with him, calling to the Theotokos rejoice, a woman full of grace, the Lord is with you. Today is the beginning <laughs> of our salvation, and the Son of God becomes the Virgin Son, and Gabriel announces the grace of this good news. Let us also join with him, calling to the Theotokos, rejoice. protection of Christians unshameable. Intercessor to our holy maker unwavering. Please reject not the prayerful cries of those who are in sin. Instead come to us for you our God. Your loving help bring on to us who are cycling the faith to you. Hasten to intercede and speak now to supplicate as a protection for all time. They all talk us for the soul. Let us pray to the Lord. For you, our God, are holy, and to you we offer up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Hey, hey, hey. 
Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, for he has regarded the humility of his servant. Wisdom. The reading is from the second universal letter of Peter. Let us be attentive. Beloved, this is now the second letter that I have written to you, and in both of them I have aroused your sincere mind the way of reminder that you should remember the predictions of the holy prophets and the commandment of the Lord and Savior through your apostles. First first of all, you must understand this, that scoffers will will come in the days with scoffing, following their own passions and saying, where is the promise of his coming? For ever since the fathers fell asleep, All things have continued as they were from the beginning of creation. They deliberately ignore this fact, that by the word of God, heavens existed long ago, and an earth formed out of water and by means of water, through which the world that then existed was deluged with water and perished. But by the same word, the heavens and earth now that now exist have been stored up for fire, being kept until the day of judgment and destruction of ungodly men. But do, but do not ignore this one fact, beloved, that with the Lord one day is as a thousand years, and a thousand years as one day. The Lord is not slow about his promise, as some count slowness, but is forbearing toward you, not wishing that any should perish, but that all should reach repentance. But the day of the Lord will come like a thief, and then the heavens will pass away with loud noise, and the elements will be dissolved with fire, and the earth and the works that are upon it will be burned up. Since all these things are thus to be dissolved, what sort of person ought to you to be in lives of holiness and godliness, waiting for and hastening the coming of the day of God, because of which the heavens will be kindled and dissolved, and the elements will melt with fire? But according to his promise, we wait for the new heavens and a new earth in which righteousness dwells. Therefore, beloved, since you wait for these, be zealous to find, be fond by him, without spot or blemish and at peace. And count the forbearance of our Lord our salvation, so also our beloved brother Paul wrote to you according to the wisdom given him. Speaking of this as he does in all letters, there are some things in them hard to understand, which the ignorant and unstable twist to their own destruction, as do other scriptures. You therefore, beloved, knowing this beforehand, will wear lest you be carried away with the arrow of lawless men and lose your own stability, but grow in the grace and knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. To him be the glory both now and to the day of eternity. Amen. Peace be with you, the reader. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Wisdom arise, let us 
us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be with you all. And with your spirit. The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Let us be attentive. Glory to you, Lord. Glory to you. The Lord said to his disciples, In those days after that tribulation, the sun will be darkened, and the moon will not give its light, and the stars will be falling from heaven, and the powers in heavens will be shaken, and then they will see the Son of Man coming in clouds with great power and glory. And he will send out the angels and gather his elect from the four winds, from the ends of the earth to the ends of heaven. From the fig tree learn its lesson. As soon as its branches become tender and puts forth its leaves, you know that summer is near. So also when you see these things taking place, you know he is near at the very gates. Truly I say to you, this generation will not pass away before all these things take place, but heaven and earth will pass away. But my words will not pass away. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Wisdom. Again in countless times fall down before you and implore you, a good one who loves mankind, that you have regarded our prayer with cleanse our souls and bodies, ever defiled with flesh and spirit, and grant to us to stand before your holy altar of sacrifice, free of guilt and condemnation. Grant also, God, to those who pray with us progress in life, faith, and spiritual understanding. Grant that we always worship you with awe and love, partake of your holy mysteries without guilt or condemnation, be deemed worthy of your celestial kingdom. That ever guarded by your might, we may ascribe glory to you, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Oh, 
Πάντων ημών μνηστή Κύριος ο Θεός εν τη βασιλεία αυτού πάντοτε νυν και αή και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων. Με το Λόρ Αργάρ, remember all of us in his kingdom, always now and forever and to the ages of ages. Τη ιεροσύνη σου, μυστικό σου, μυστικό σου, αυτή την αντιμήνυση και ει όνομα σου μην. Ο Σίμωνο, ο Σίμωνο, ο Σίμωνο, θέλω να τον αφηρηθώ στο σώμα. Τον ζητώ να καθίσει και όνομα σου. Αμήν, την κοινοχυδεύσει στα πέθα των. complete our prayer to the Lord for the precious gifts here presented let us pray to the Lord for this holy house and for those who enter it with faith reverence and the fear of God let us pray to the Lord For our deliverance from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us.
us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. That the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask the Lord. For an angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask the Lord. For pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask the Lord. For that which is good and beneficial for our souls and for peace for the world, let us ask the Lord. This, o Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask the Lord. And let us ask for a Christian end to our life, peace without shame and suffering, and for a good defense before the awesome judgment seat of Christ. Christ o Lord. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious Lady, the Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. <laughs> Through the mercies of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your holy, good, and life-creating Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. <laughs> it is peace be with you all and with your spirit. let us love one another so that with oneness of mind we may confess Father, Son and Holy Spirit Trinity one in and on divide. The doors, the doors, and wisdom, let us be attentive. I believe in one God, Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten not created, of one essence with the Father, through whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and of the Virgin Mary and became man. He was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate and suffered and was buried, and he rose on the third day according to the scriptures, and he ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again with glory to judge living and the dead. His kingdom shall have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the creator of life, who proceeds from the Father, who together with the Father and the Son is worshiped and glorified, who spoke through the prophets. In one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the age to come. Amen. <clears throat> let us stand aright. Let us stand in awe. Let us be attentive that we may present the holy offering in peace. Mercy of peace. A sacrifice of praise. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God the Father and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Let us 
us lift up our hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord. It is proper right to Him to bless you, to praise you, to give thanks to you, to worship you in every place of your dominion. If you are God, and nothing conceivable, invisible, and comprehensible, existing forever, forever the same, you and your begotten Son, the Holy Spirit, you brought us out of nothing to being, and we have fallen away. You raised us up again. You left nothing undone until you led us up to heaven and granted us your kingdom, which is to come. For all these things we thank your only begotten Son, your Holy Spirit. For all these things we know and do not know. For blessings manifest and hidden, yet be bestowed upon us. We thank you also for this liturgy which we have been deigned to receive from our hands. Even though thousands of archangels, tens of thousands of angels stand around you. The cherubim and seraphim, six winged, many eyed, soaring aloft upon their wings. Singing the triumphal hymn, exclaiming, proclaiming, and saying, Aios, 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 Kyrios, Abaoth, Pliris, Oranos, Kei, Yitis, Doxis, O, O, Sanna, and Isi, Take it, this is my body, which is broken for you, for the remission of sins. Likewise, after some took the cup, saying, Drink of this, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many, for the remission of sins. Remembering, therefore, the saving commandment, all that was done for our sake, the cross, the resurrection on the third day, the ascension into heaven, the enthronement of the right hand, and the second glorious coming again. Your own, of your own, we offer to you in all and for all. The Son, Si Prosferomen, Gata Panda, Gedi Apanda. We praise you, we bless you, we give thanks, and we pray to you, Lord of God. Once again, we offer the spiritual worship without shedding blood. We beseech, pray, and entreat you. Send down your Holy Spirit upon us, upon these gifts here presented. May God have mercy upon me, the sinner, and save me, O thirst and mouth, and the food of your May God have mercy upon me, the sinner, and save me. And make this bread to be the precious body of your Christ. Amen. That which in this cup, the precious blood of your Christ. Amen. Changing them by your Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Should it be those partake the vigilance of soul. Forgiveness of sins, communion of your Holy Spirit, fullness of the kingdom of heaven, boldness before you, not in judgment and condemnation. Yet we offer the spiritual worship of those who have reposed in the faith. Forefathers, fathers, patriarchs, prophets, apostles, preachers, evangelists, martyrs, confessors, ascetics, and every righteous spirit made perfect in faith. Especially for our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious Lady, the Theotokos and Ever Virgin Mary. For Pamphilos, the martyr Flavianos, Patriarch of the Pons and Hope, and Verbo Romanos, the martyr whose memory we celebrate today, and for all your saints who visit, supplications, visit, O God, or those who follow the Holy Spirit, life eternal. Thank you. 
Among the first, remember, Lord, Archbishop Alexios, grant him to early churches in peace, safety, honor, and health unto length of days, rightly teaching the word of your truth. And remember those whom each one of us has in mind, and all the people. And all the people. And grant that with one voice and one heart we may glorify and praise your most honorable and majestic name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. And the mercies of our great God and Savior Jesus Christ be with you all. And with your Having commemorated all the saints again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the precious gifts here presented and consecrated, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That our God, who loves mankind, having accepted them as holy in the celestial mystical altar, as an offering of spiritual fragrance, may in return send down upon us divine grace. In the gift of the Holy Spirit, let us pray. Lord, have mercy. Having asked for the unity of the faith and for the communion of the Holy Spirit, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. To you, we entrust the loving Master our whole life and hope we beseech, pray, and implore you, grant us for taking up the lost mysteries, for the sacred spiritual day, the clear confirmation of sins, forgiveness of transgressions, the communion of the Holy Spirit, the hands of the kingdom of heaven, both for you not judgment or condemnation. Que cada axio soni mas des, don da parisias, e cada crito stoman epigalistes, don e puranium theon batera, que legin, paterimon, no endi suranis, aias nite tono masu, e theto in vasiliasu, genicite do theli masu, o serura no que pitisis, Τον άρτον ημών των εκκλήσεων δώσιν σήμερον και άφεσ ημίν τα αφιλήματα ημών ως και ημίς αφίεμεν τους οφελέτες ημών και ημίς ενέης ημάς εσπυρασμών αλλά ρίσε ημάς από του πονηρού. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever into the ages of ages. Peace be with you all. And with your spirit. 
Let us bow our heads to the Lord. We give thanks to you, invisible King, who by abundance, power, fashion, the universe, and the multitude of your mercy brought all things from nothing into being. Look down from heaven, O Master, by those who bow their heads before thee, have not bowed before flesh and blood, but before the awesome God. Therefore, Master, make smooth and beneficial for us all whatever lies ahead according to need of each. Save with those who sail, travel those who travel, heal the sick, physician of our souls and bodies. Through the grace, compassion, love for mankind, of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your holy good and life creating spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Our King Lord Jesus Christ, our God, and our place, and for the throne of glory, your kingdom, you come sanctify us from the throne of the Father and high. And our present among us have visibly here with your mighty hand, great the most pure body and precious blood to us, and through us to all your people. May God have mercy upon me, the sinner, and save me. May God have mercy upon me, the sinner, and save me. Let us be attentive. The holy gifts for the holy people of God. The Lamb of God is apportioned and distributed. A portion of the Bible to every nation of the world, sent by those partaking. Jesus Christ is the God. Jesus Christ conquers. Jesus Christ is the God. The fullness of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Blessed is the fervor of your saints. Always now and ever, to the age of ages. Amen. forever. Alleluia. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good morning. Today, is the Wednesday of the first week that we have 
that leads us into Lent. It's called the period of the Triodion. And so we have three weeks of kind of getting ourselves ready to enter into Lent. We're going to talk in a few minutes about what that means. But I wanted to start today by talking about the saint who we're celebrating today. His name is Saint Pamphilos. Pamphilos, that's kind of a funny name. I don't know, it. I don't have any friends named Pamphilos. But Pamphilos was a saint who lived a long, long time ago. And so I was reading about him. I was trying to learn something about Pamphilos because I wanted to share something about him with you guys here this morning. And, you know, one of the things, he's famous for a few things. One of the things he's famous for is his library. He was a great collector of books and of information. And that stood out to me because I like a good book. And I like a good bookshelf full of books. That's even better, right? Some of you in this room here are the same way. Maybe it's not books. Maybe you like to collect information. Maybe you have a favorite animal or a favorite country or a favorite subject that you like to know everything about. And that's what St. Pamphilos was doing, collecting this huge library of books. He studied the Gospels in depth. And as he was doing this, as he was collecting this information, he was then sharing that with students. He was actually a teacher, and he, he used some of his money that he had from his family. He used some of his money that he had from his family to help students who were too poor to go to school so that they could go to school. All right. But what's all this have to do with church and God and Lent? Well, sometimes we can get kind of distracted by becoming collectors of information. We can come distracted by trying to learn everything there is to learn about one thing in particular, can't we? Sometimes we do this even in the church. We want to know everything there is in the Bible. We want to learn all our Bible stories. We want to know everything about what's happening in church. We want to be able to explain everything. But sometimes we can get distracted by all these facts and information. And that becomes what it's all about for us. But for St. Pamphilos, that's not what it was about. St. Pamphilos had this huge collection of books, but he didn't sit in his library only reading them to keep them for himself, right? He was reading and trying to learn everything he could about God so that he could share that love with others. He did that through sponsoring and teaching, but he also did that through his whole life and even, even in his death because St. Pamphilos was arrested tortured, and eventually killed for being a Christian. So it wasn't just about collecting these books or information for him. It was about learning the love of God and then living our lives in that love. In the epistle that we heard this morning, so beautifully read, St. Peter tells us that we should be found spotless, and without blame. That is what St. Pamphilus was reading all of these books for, collecting all this information, so that he could be found spotless and without blame. But how do you do that? How do you live a perfect life? Is anybody in this room perfect? No, we're not. We're all sinners. We all make bad choices in our life. And so... If we want to live a, a, a life that's spotless and blameless and perfect and pure, like St. Peter tells us to, that is what this period of the year is for, is to teach us how to do that. 
Lent is our school of repentance. Repentance is a change of mind, a change of heart, a change of action. And that's what we are called to do. And that's what St. Pamphilo saw in all those books about God he was collecting and the people that he, saw, that he had in his life that he got to share the love of God with until finally he got to witness to what it meant to be that love and his faith in the resurrection, his belief that Jesus died and rose from the dead so that we too could be raised from the dead. And so let's use St. Pomphilos today as an example, yes, of learning and of teaching, but also of living that life that we learn about in church, of living this life of repentance that we...
Save, O God, your people, and bless your inheritance. We have seen the true light. We have received the heavenly spirit. We have found the true faith, worshiping the undivided Trinity. For the Trinity has saved us. Us, always, now, and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us must be filled with your praise, O Lord, that we may sing of your glory, because you have made us worthy to partake of your holy mysteries. Keep us in your sanctification that all day long we may meditate upon your righteousness. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Arise and partake, divine, holy, pure, immortal, heavenly life, creating and awesome mysteries of Christ. Let us worthily give thanks to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Having prayed for a perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless day, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. For you are sanctification, and to you we give glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us go forth in peace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. O Lord, bless those who praise you, and sanctify those who place their trust in you. Save your people, and bless your inheritance. Protect the whole body of your church. Sanctify those who love the beauty of your house. Glorify them Return by your divine power. And forsake us not who place our hope in you. Grant peace to your world, to your churches, to the clergy, to those in public service, to the armed forces, and to all your people. For every good and perfect gift is from above coming down from you, the Father of lights. To you we give glory, thanksgiving, and worship to the Father and to the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Blessed be the name of the Lord from this time forth and to the ages. Ito no mai kiriu evlogi me no na potunin te os tu eonos. The name of the Lord be blessed from this time forth and to the ages. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. May the blessing of the Lord and his mercy come upon you through his divine grace and love for mankind, always, now, and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to our God, our hope, glory to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Holy Master, give the blessing. May Christ, our true God, through the intercessions of his all-pure and all-immaculate Holy Mother, the power of the precious and life-giving cross, the protection of the venerable glorious prophet and forerunner John the Baptist, of the holy glorious praiseworthy apostles, the holy glorious triumphant martyrs of our righteous and God-bearing fathers, of the holy righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, of Pamphilios the Martyr, Flavianos, Patriarch of Constantinople, and the Venerable Romanos the Martyr, whose memory we celebrate today. Of our Father among the Saints, John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, whose liturgy we celebrated. 
of all the saints, have mercy upon us and save us, for it's a good God who loves mankind. Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy upon us and save us. Amen. May the blessings of the Holy Trinity be with all of us. Good morning. God bless all of you. You guys can be seated for a quick second.